It's one of the most common things I've been hearing lately. I want to buy a home. I want to move. I want to sell mine. I got it in the pandemic and now I hate it. But the interest rates are just so high. Well, there are a few solutions to high interest rates and most people aren't aware of all of them. We'll go over those today just so you know what's available to you. So one of the first and most common ways that you can get a lower interest rate is to buy down the rate. And the biggest objection that people have when they hear about this is that it only lowers the rate for two years. Now, if you look at the economic projections, they expect rates to be lower by 2024. So what that means is that you do this right now while prices are where they are without appreciating for another year or competition will be a little bit lower right now as compared to when rates go down later on and you get the home before the prices get driven up like crazy. Now the way that this works out is that you get a credit, you buy down the rate and it acts as a payment supplement for the first two years. So let's say that your interest rate is 6.5%. The first year your payment would be as if your interest rate was 4.5%. And the second year your payment would be as if your interest rate was 5.5%. The third year it would go back up to the 6.5% and the plan is that you'd be refinancing before that happens. The other option that's had some popularity is an adjustable rate mortgage. Now, a lot of people that have been around since the mid 2000s and have owned homes since then are scared off by this. The reason being is that adjustable rate mortgages back then had a thing called negative amortization. Negative amortization has now been made illegal thanks to our one time governor, Arnold Schwarzenegger. Yep, that guy did that for you. Now, what a negative amortization loan looked like is you'd get a statement that said something like, hey, your bill is $1,200 this month. However, if you'd rather, you could just pay a thousand bucks. Sounds pretty good, right? Well, next month you get a bill that says, hey, you know what? That $200 we didn't make you pay last month, now you gotta pay it. And yeah, 1,400 bucks. But if you want, we'll be cool. Only charge you a thousand. So as you can see, this could build up exponentially, especially when interest is involved. This made it so that your payment was extremely high and you actually owed a lot more than your home was worth, which caused a lot of problems for people that had mortgages like this. The new adjustable rate mortgages are not like this because like I said, good old Arnie made that illegal. And so, what people have done is that these new adjustable rate mortgages, you'll hear things like three, five, ten, one arms. And what that means is that for that first period, three, five, seven, ten years, whatever it is, you have a fixed rate mortgage. And then every year after that, your mortgage rate adjusts every year. So, yeah, that sounds pretty scary in some regards. Well, what happens if my mortgage payment goes up like crazy because interest rates are so much higher. Well, guess what? Again, you refi before that happens. That's the idea with that strategy. Another option that could be a possibility, which again asks you to refi at a later date, would be an interest only loan. Now, an interest only loan is a tool that investors usually use and you would definitely have to talk with your lender to make sure that this would make sense for your situation. The idea is, is that you're only making an interest or a payment on the interest of the loan. Then you would have a balloon payment at the end. Again, you're going to refi before that happens when rates are more favorable. That's kind of a last ditch effort if you really need to get that lower payment. Now, there is something that kind of includes everything that we talked about that's really good. It's actually a loan product that very, very, very few banks have. It's super specific. This one will give you up to $25,000 towards closing costs, which you can guess what, buy down the rate with. Now this loan has one of the best rates out there for people and it's not for everyone. If you have questions about that and how you can actually use this to compete with other buyers and make a higher offer and stand out while keeping your payment in check, 
that could be pretty interesting for you. If you know of anyone that this information could be useful for, please share this video with them. And if you have any questions about any of these, please hit me up. I'll be happy to connect you with some great people that can coach you through the mortgage process so that you feel confident in the choices that you make.